Come in, please. Right side, who's gonna bite? Why, 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 Sam? Coming back, Olaf! What? Oh, oh, bring it up, bring it up, bring it up, right there. Right there. I'll leave the teaser out for now. Just put it in the grass. You don't like it here. Clear your left side, guys. Left side. Okay, lift your ass. Get down the grass. Get down the grass. Get down the grass. Get down the grass. Okay, Dave, we're gonna go get Jeff's one. Hold your right up to the side, Barry. Woo! Look at that thing go. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Hooked on OC is proudly brought to you by the town of Ocean City, Maryland, Worcester County Tourism, the Harborside Bar and Grill, Sunset Marina, the Ocean City Fishing Center, Miller Light, Barrett Chevrolet, Sunset Grill, Mickey Finn's Bar and Grill, Red Sun Custom Apparel, Tournament Yacht Sales, the Mid-Atlantic 500,000, Crabs to Go, Park Place Jewelers, and the Ocean City Visitor's Guide. Hey everybody, what's happening? Welcome to another episode of Hooked on OC. I'm your host Scott Lennox here. Feeling a little Rastafari today. My boy Mike at Pelagic hooked us up with the 2012 gear. I got a little Bob Marlin representing on the headgear. Bob Marlin representing on the shirt gear. I'm feeling all right. And today, we're heading out with my good friend John Prather in the Ocean City Guide Service. This man, he gonna take you crabbing, he gonna take you climbing, he gonna take you fishing, and he might even take you for a boat cruise, bulls cruise. In the evening, we might do it all today. So stay tuned after the break, sit back, put down the remote, chill. Rastafi style, you're watching Hooked on OC, we'll be right back. Hooked on OC, we'll be right back. Hey there, coming to you from the casual, rustic atmosphere of the Harborside Bar and Grill. Just relaxing, sipping on a fresh squeezed orange crush. I'm telling you, this incredible restaurant has a bountiful menu. Homemade soups, over 20 appetizers, a variety of sandwiches, Angus beef burgers, fresh fish, seafood, steaks, pork chops, and made-to-order pasta dishes. Choosing your meal won't be easy. All that, plus a great happy hour and awesome entertainment. Harborside, fighting scurvy every day. The Mid-Atlantic 500,000, boat for boat, the richest marlin and tuna tournament in the world. Known for its great fishing, warm hospitality, and camaraderie, the Mid-Atlantic is a must-attend event for competitive bill fishing anglers. The fishing action and fun take place in two ports, home base for the tournament in Cape May, New Jersey, and Sunset Marina, tournament headquarters in Ocean City, Maryland. If you're planning on doing some competitive bill fishing this year, get the best bang for your buck and choose the Mid-Atlantic 500,000. Register online now at ma500.com. What do you get when you brew a light beer from scratch? A light beer that tastes like beer should. Miller Lite. Never watered down. Barrett Chevrolet in Berlin, Maryland has been serving the Delmarva Peninsula for over 60 years. Whether you're looking for a dependable Chevy pickup to pull your boat and trailer, or something economical like the 42 mile per gallon Chevy Cruze, Barrett Chevrolet is your local dealer for quality new or pre-owned cars and trucks. We have a full service center and a full collision center, and we always use genuine GM parts. So come see Russ, John, Steve, and the crew at Barrett Chevrolet on Old Ocean City Boulevard, just off Route 50 in Berlin, Maryland. Sunset Marina is Ocean City's premier full-service marina resort. Sunset Marina is located just five minutes from the Ocean City beach and boardwalk. Sunset's charter fleet boasts the finest fleet of sport fishing boats in the mid-Atlantic, all operated by Coast Guard licensed captains. One look at Sunset's amenities and you're hooked for good. Contact Sunset Marina today to book your fishing charter. Call 1-877-514-FISH. And now, back for more Hooked on OC. Brought you to my honey hole. Yeah, buddy. So, uh, listen, man, tell me about the new boat. What's going on with the uh, for the season this year? Well, this year, you know, I've done the offshore fishing there for a while. I wanted to do something a little closer to home, so got a little Carolina skiff and going to do a little inshore Fishing, some crabbing, some clearly air. It didn't take long. We've been here, what, five minutes? Not even, Already probably. Got, yep. Yeah. Got some clam. 
See, he didn't even believe me on the shallow water clam. It's cold, man. We don't. I don't want to be. You see, you see my boots. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so, you know, it's just something different. I've always What's... loved inshore fishing. Everywhere I've traveled all over the world, you know, I've always, you know, we did a lot of light tackle fishing, inshore fishing. And I, I thought it was just a good idea. Love What's... working with families and people. Yeah. Well, I mean, there's a market for this down here now. You know, we've got. The, especially where you're docked. I mean, you're docked yeah. right there at the Castaways Campground. So it, it's all a, summer long, you have family staying there at the campground, a phone call away otherwise. Um, and there's a market for this down here now. You're cheap. What, what's the prices? You know, I'm $100 an hour. So, I mean, for the way the economy is and everything, you can't beat it. Take your family out yeah. on a sandbar, you go crabbing, clamming, you know, the flounder fishing. It's getting better and better by the day. You know, usually try to keep it a two hour minimum, six people. Max and you know we'll go have a good time. So and anything they feel like doing. Anything. They feel like going flounder fishing, you which know, you're, you're excellent at. You guys caught a you and Johnny caught a ten pounder a year or two ago yeah, underneath the bridge. Ago, yep. uh, crabbing. You got obviously it. clamming. You know, and, and a lot of things we're catering to at the campground this year is just getting people out of there. They come in motorhomes, they don't have a car. So I'm kind of doing a transportation thing. Evening booze cruises to West Ocean City. Nice. It's on, uh, we can go to lunch, take the family to Harborside for lunch. You know, I've already done that this year. You, you know, just, just to get out on the water. It's not all about fishing. So for a hundred bucks an hour, a couple of hundred bucks for a four hour trip probably. Yep. Your boat is theirs for that amount of time. You got it. Whatever you feel like doing. Whatever they want to do. You know, if we got hardcore fly fishermen, they want to fly fish all day, we'll go do that. You know, we I'll go to where we need to go. I've got all brand new tackle, all the best tackle, all the best gear. Yeah. Ready for it. And and you, with this boat, you can get just offshore if you feel like it, right? Oh yeah. You know, and here when those at the bunker show up like they did last year, you got great shark fishing right off the beach. Yeah, yeah. You know, on a nice day, pop a kite up, some live bait. You know, you can just do whatever. Um, you know, well, you know what I feel like doing. Get some clam. clam. We gotta get some dinner. <laughs> Let's catch a couple. <laughs> I had to uh, I had to call in a phone a friend. Oh, oh, oh! I had to call in a phone a friend. And Johnny's got the right stuff here with everything. You don't have to bring basically you don't bring anything, right? No. You get you on the boat. Up, you know, I, I can bring I can have lunch catered for you there at the campground. <laughs> or <laughs> I, we come catch lunch. I told you when we were coming out here, I've never clammed on dry land before. And this you is thought I was crazy. I thought you were nuts. You uh, know, but, you know, ER bounds at sunset. And Brian Behe, they've done it in the winter. I've seen him catch some, but you know, whatever. You guys yeah, in the wintertime, you, you know, we've caught them here. I, I was doing this two months ago. You look for little holes. You look like we were doing, like right here. You got the little co different coloration of the tide line. Yeah. You get the dark sand. You know, you, the clams don't go anywhere. They're not a migratory no, species. Right. They're here. I had to call on a phone a friend. So my buddy Jim Crawl, golf coach over at the Stephen Decatur High School, who's also a bi biology teacher. He wanted to be a marine biologist for the longest time. He and I have been friends for about, jeez, hate to admit this, 25 years now. Um, but what he says is the way these guys work out, what happens is the male uh, clam and the female clam, they both spray their stuff out into the wild blue yonder. And just by happen chance, those two things get together, the male sperm, the female eggs. They join together, they find their way to the bottom just by chance, they settle down, and that's where the clam gestation uh, starts. They dig their way down after a few days, usually about that big. Johnny, you caught one a couple minutes ago, didn't you? Yeah. You so said just throw them back right here, these little guys. You know, and, and we've, I've actually seen them here on an incoming tide where they're just laying on top. You know, so, caught them smaller now. Now, that's not a legal clam. Right. It needs to be one inches, but... You, you can actually walk around. A lot of times we'll have the little, you know, the small children and stuff. They'll be walking around and they, they'll pick them up and they'll be like, oh, I got one. They yeah, don't right. think it's dead and it's actually alive. Yeah. So, yep, that's the beginning of good goodness on the table yes, right, right there. <laughs> we'll let that bad boy go. And listen, when, the, the legal size limit for a clam, like he said, is one inch, which means if you have a one inch ring, they have a cull ring, and you drop him through, if he makes it through, no matter which angle you put him at, he's no good. Let him go. Clams this big, that's perfect. And cherry stones, when you catch them that big, absolutely perfect if they don't open up after you steam them don't eat them don't pry in there and try and get the goodness out because he's probably more than likely been dead before you cooked them no good for your stomach or the afterwards so listen we say we catch a couple yep uh, we're gonna go out and catch this incoming tide here right here in the ocean city inlet the tide's coming in we might go try and catch some of these shad maybe a rockfish and you know my favorites flounder so stay tuned after the break we're gonna do a little bit of clamming we're on the ocean city guide service boat with john prather we'll back in a second nice Hooked on OC, we'll be right back. Where to go, what to do, it's all in your free copy of the Ocean City Visitor's Guide. It's the most comprehensive guide available with the area's best fold-out map. And don't leave your guest room without your Passport to Savings coupon book, exclusively from the Visitor's Guide. 
It's packed full of money-saving coupons, so don't get caught in Ocean City without your passport to savings. The Ocean City Visitor's Guide, Restaurant and Menu Guide, and the Passport to Savings Coupon Book will give you everything you need to make the most of your vacation here in Ocean City. You can hardly hit a ball in Ocean City without it landing on the green. With 17 championship golf courses, Ocean City is a golfer's haven, and it's right here in our backyard, including Ocean City's premier golf course, Eagles Landing, offering superb conditions and a hospitable staff, a variety of Bermuda fairways, and bent grass greens. Eagles Landing is a golfer's paradise. Experience it today. Find great local deals at oceocean.com golf. Just a short drive away. Are you looking for the best crabs on this side of the Chesapeake Bay? Then head on over to Crabs to Go on the corner of Route 50 and 589. For over 20 years, Crabs to Go has been bringing you the fattest, tastiest crabs on the eastern shore, available by the bushel or by the dozen. We also offer a full menu, including shrimp, clams, oysters, scallops, lobster tails, crab meat, and soft crabs. Call ahead for fast, hot carryout. Or stop by for our homemade crab cakes, soups, and salads. This is where the locals come. Crabs to Go, Routes 50 and 589, West Ocean City. Sunset Provisions has everything you need, including groceries and snacks, marine supplies, apparel for every season, ice, sodas, beer, and wine, inshore and offshore tackle, pelagic offshore clothing, Costa Del Mar sunglasses, Willie's custom trolling baits, Bait Masters tournament winning ballyhoo, and the best live bait selection in town. So come see me and the friendliest, most knowledgeable staff in the business here at Sunset Provisions just inside the entrance to Sunset Marina in West Ocean City. And now back for more Hooked on OC. Hi, I'm making a bluefish. We'll take it. We'll take it, whatever it takes. Allow me to enter. Let me allow me to throw a fish on the ground. Allow me to introduce you to the Hickory Shad. Really, really cool fish. Early spring, they move in here with the bluefish. Illegal to keep these guys. They're kind of an endangered species. They're, uh, they're kind of few and far between right now, so you're not allowed to keep them. They school up right with these bluefish, so we'll probably maybe catch a couple bluefish with these shad mixed in. Big difference. No teeth in there, so I can put my thumb in there, no problem. Really fun fighting fish. They're jumping all over the place to catch a couple more. Whoa! Endangered, Scott. Endangered. And slippery, and slippery. <laughs> Yeah! Get on pet! Looks like a double. And a double. and catch some of these shad. I got a couple of nice ones, I think, John. Can you see them back there yet? Another rookie move. That's why it felt so nice. Got double? I am a rookie shad fisherman. I'll admit that. <laughs> double, double, toil and trouble. Nice. Yeah! Nice shad there. Shad. These guys come in here every spring. You know, it gets really good from now for about another month. They feed them little glass minnows, the minnows that are coming in. 
Everything's migrating here. They're hickory shads, what they call. They, no one really knows. I've been reading about them. They come in here, to, they spawn actually in fresh water, like up around the Chesapeake, all the rivers. And uh, where they go in the wintertime, they don't know a lot. They used to go as far up as up in New York but with all the dams and stuff. Everyone says that they, you know, really this is about the most northern they, they get anymore. But it's pretty cool fish, and yeah, I mean, actually they're this, in danger. This is fun. Yeah, so at, you're not even really targeting these guys. We're not specifically targeting the shad. We're out here following some bluefish around. Um, because what they do is they, they call it, uh, what do they call it? You're not allowed to target the species, so we are we're not fishing. targeting the species. We're you got fishing. a bluefish there, don't you? We're, uh, no. Not two shad. I caught a couple bluefish already. Two shad. Nice. So we just get them back in the water as quick as soon as we can. Nice. Great fish. Hickory shad with the Ocean City Guide Service. Fun fishing, buddy. Hooked on OC, we'll be right back. Hi, I'm Jimmy Fields, President and CEO of Tournament Yacht Sales. We are your full service yacht brokerage. Whether it's buying or selling your new or used custom or production boat, we have the sales staff that can assist you in any of your boating needs. Whether it be finding a captain, a mate, moving your boat up and down the coast, or selling. We have locations in Florida, Maryland, North Carolina, and Delaware. We can be reached on the web at www.tournamentyachtsales.com or 1-866-NEW-YACHT. Sunset Grill, a cool Caribbean atmosphere. A unique dining or social experience overlooking the water. Freshly prepared entrees and appetizers for every palate. Casual dining in a fun atmosphere. Relax in our comfortable, elegant lounges with your special libation. Sunset Grill, a place to relax and enjoy. There's nothing more exciting than a day of offshore sport fishing. The sun, the sea, and a boatload of your friends trying to land the big one. Ocean City Fishing Center is the area's number one charter fleet with 37 boats sailing out every day looking for the big fish. Tuna, marlin, dolphin, and shark. Every crew that sails is dedicated to your excitement. And all our captains are licensed by the U.S. Coast Guard for your safety. Headboats are also available for family fishing fun. Whether your party is big or small, call Ocean City Fishing Center. Tight lines and good times. And now, back for more Hooked on OC. This is really, really simple setup. Any kind of spinning rod will do, and actually you're going to prefer a spinning rod lightweight over something like a casting. I told you, when it comes to flounder fishing, I love a casting reel. So this is for spin fishing. You definitely want to use a spin fishing rod. Simple as this. This is called a spec rig. A very small bucktail-like rig, one up top, one about a foot and a half behind it. You can get these in any tackle shop for $1.29. Going out the door, $1.29. Look for the birds. We've got a really, really great uh, evening here in Ocean City. We've got MR Ducks blasting some music behind us. We're having a great time. Captain John's put us on them right here. Difficult to find them at first because they weren't around. We don't know where to cast. As soon as these birds start working the surface, we know exactly where to go. So, birds this way. Cast that way. One way to fish them really good is get that rod tip low and just jerking, jerking along the surface. That's it. Simple as that. Man, these are fun fish to catch too. They jump on, and a lot of times the school is so big, if you let it sit there for a second, it'll get doubled up. Bimini release. What's up, guys? Good. My buddies Pat and John over here on the John, they're right in the middle of them, so they must know where they are. I'm going to cast right beside their boat, because if I cast right beside their boat, I think I'm going to hook something. Hey, one jump right there in front of you. See him chasing the minnows? See, I told you. 
There you go. I had a bite. Those guys know where they are. Some of the cats right beside them. Anywhere. Pat Hurley knows where to find them. There he's back here jumping. Look at that. Your mate does work hard for you. Tipping is customary. 15 to 20 percent, please. He's sacrificing his own stuff so I can get catch my fish. That's how a true guide does it. Let the customer catch the fish. Bimini releases both sides of the boat. I love it. I don't even have to get my hands scaly. I've been challenged now. I've been challenged for one cast for a fish. Hold on, hold on. Just give me one cast. That's in a honey hole. Oh! Nice. Pretty work. That was not edited. shed listen we said it once before but this is very very serious these are a federally moratorium to fish federal moratoriums on fish are very very serious like I said you're not even supposed to target it but if you're caught holding fish meaning you have them in your possession jail time not tickets jail time so he's going back Harborside I guess we're going to Harborside Hooked on OC, we'll be right back. What brings you down to Harborside today? I love the orange crushes and the music. Orange crush. And the orange crush. Orange crushes. The orange crush. It's all about the crushes. Came here to see you. What's not the love? Isn't he cute? Just a couple drinks. I love the rockfish, orange crush, rockfish. Enjoying the weather. Aren't you ready to be at Harborside? Motorcycle ride. Motorcycle ride. Several orange crushes. Having a good time. Harborside's the best. So have you seen it? No. Have you? Mm -mm. So where did he go? Oh my god. Are you kidding me? So where did he go? He went to Harrods. What? Oh my <laughs> gosh, what, did they go together? <laughs> so where, where did, did he go? go? Thank goodness oh he my. went to Park Place Jewelers. Oh my god. So pretty. So, you like fishing? So do we. Check out Hooked on OC every Sunday morning at 7.30 on WMDT. Hey, more bills, more bills. Captain Rob, you out there? Red Sun Custom Apparel is Ocean City's leader in t-shirts, embroidery, and promotional products. Simply put, the best graphics you'll see anywhere. Call Red Sun today at 302-988-8300.
Worcester County, located on Maryland's eastern shore, is Maryland's only seaside county and is known for its clean sandy beaches, outdoor recreation, steamed crabs, and the famous wild ponies on Assateague Island's national and state seashore parks. Worcester County has everything to offer from its historical towns to Ocean City, filled with a three-mile boardwalk, amusement parks for the family, and its wonderful lifeguarded beaches. And for all the fishermen out there, Ocean City is home to the richest sport fishing tournament in the world and is the white marlin capital of the world. Visit Worcester County and discover its wonders. And now back for more Hooked on OC. What a day. What a day. What a day. I'll tell you what, man, the flounder fishing right now in Ocean City is kind of eh. You agree? It's, it's getting there. It's still pretty slow. But... That's the optimistic outlook. I yeah. like that. Yeah. It, it, right now it's not real good. Um, but it's going to be good. It's not Watch Creek, but it's coming this way. It all comes up from the south to us and eventually gets here. Like right now, they're catching yellowfin tuna off North Carolina. They'll be here in probably less than a month. Um, maybe yeah, a little bit the more. first bluefin. What? First bluefin yeah, a couple was days ago. Ocean City yep. Fishing Center, 70 pounds or something the yep. other day. 72 pounds, caught some blue sharks, some dolphins. Small mako caught in weight at the yep. fishing center, so it's on its way up here. Those guys are out there in 500 fathoms in the Baltimore Canyon, but soon enough, we're gonna be out there. We gotta wait until it gets a little bit better before we go waste a day of uh, not doing nothing, but it's really, really good. But Johnny, dude, thanks, man. No problem. Anytime, Absolutely. guys. Awesome. Yep. Turn this it. time of year, you can't beat it. You can't beat it. I mean, and for a family of, what do you take, six people? Take six people. You know, if I need a, need a mate, I'll bring a mate. Normally, I don't. Okay. If requested, I'll bring one. For tog fishing, I'll bring one. For the most part, I just kind of keep it hands on. Yeah. You know, try to teach everything, you know, and, and just, just teach them everything about inshore fishing. Make make them have a good time. Get them hands on hands on involved. And I think down at the uh, down at, your, at Castaways, you're going to get a lot of people walking up because the campground there is really really busy in the summertime. So it's, it's great. You know, we're Doctor Castaways. Got a great little slip right by the beach, right by the bar. Come check it out. You know, you always go there and have a drink. It's a nice little hideaway spot. I found out my friend is around the place the other day. There you go. Yeah. So I'm going to stop in there and say hello. Yep. Um, so people that aren't going to find you as a walk up, how can they get in touch with you online or telephone that sort of Easiest stuff? Easiest deal is just punch in ocfishingguide.com. You know, right online you can get to my website and get my phone number. My phone number is 301-991-3308. Uh, you know, check it out. Get on the website. All the marinas and tackle stops around here pretty much have my cards, my no cards. You can get on Castaway's website as well. They're actually a booking agent for me. You can book through them. You can book through me. This is a phone call away. You know, That's awesome. It's catered to whatever whatever you want to do. You know, we get a harbor side, we get a lunch, we go to dinner. Yeah, we're heading Sunset there Sunset cruise. Heading there now. Going to have a little seafood pasta and a couple of orange crushes. The original fresh squeeze orange crush. You probably had an orange crush someplace else. This is where they made it first. Uh, bro, thanks again. No problem, awesome, guys. awesome time. Thanks. Gotta love very catching much. a fish on every cast. It's, it's beautiful. I mean, yeah. I mean, we could put bets on like, give me, give me one cast. <laughs> give me one cast to catch a fish, and I I'll, pull I won. I'll pull it off. You won. You were in the boat. Won. So we're allowed to do that. And listen, go to the website, Facebook. You gotta hit us up on Facebook, okay? www.facebook.com. Throw in the slash hooked on OC all together. And if you want to get the show directly, go to YouTube. YouTube.com backslash unseen pro. You can hit all the videos we make here in Ocean City. John Prather, I'm Scott Lennox. Thanks very much for watching this episode of Hooked on OC. We're going to head into Harborside. We'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Nice. Thanks, dude. Thanks so much. Here we go. Clear seat.